In a recent episode of MSNBC's Morning Joe Fainess, host Joe Scarborough expressed deep concern over the enthusiastic response from some attendees at a Trump rally in Lissitz, Pennsylvania, where the former president made comments that many perceived as inciting violence against journalists. The unsettling incident has raised questions about the normalization of hostile rhetoric in American politics and the motivations behind supporters' responses. Scarborough was taken aback by the crowd's applause following Trump's inflammatory statements, openly wondering what could drive individuals to cheer such remarks. Scarborough's reaction underscored a troubling trend in political discourse, where violent language is met with acceptance or even enthusiasm by certain groups. Trump's remarks came as part of his broader rhetoric emphasizing distrust in the media, which he frequently labels as dishonest or the enemy of the people. At the rally, Trump reportedly leaned heavily into his familiar claims of election fraud while taking pointed aim at the press. For Scarborough, a former congressman, the spectacle of a public cheering on threats against journalists was especially jarring and indicative of a cultural shift where such extreme viewpoints are increasingly accepted. The incident has further ignited discussions around the influence of rhetoric on public opinion, especially among those who hold powerful platforms. Scarborough's co-hosts, including Mika Brzezinski, joined in expressing concerns about how easily hostile attitudes towards journalists and other public figures are spreading in the political arena. The discussion highlighted not only the danger to journalists, but also to the democratic principles of open communication and accountability that journalism is meant to protect. This wasn't the only highlight from MSNBC's coverage of the ongoing political tensions surrounding the 2024 presidential election. Throughout the day, MSNBC programs like The Rachel Maddow Show, Den, Deadline, White House N, and The Readout continue to provide analysis on the implications of such rhetoric, particularly regarding public trust and safety in political campaigns. Scarborough and others on Morning Joe have pointed out that such statements, particularly when met with approval, contribute to a culture of aggression, potentially inspiring followers to act on extreme beliefs. As the election draws near, with Trump and his opponent Kamala Harris both vying for support in battleground states, tensions are palpable, and the stakes remain high. Experts on MSNBC, like Steve Kornacki, have been closely following polling and voter sentiment, providing insights on the shifting dynamics. The response to Trump's remarks underscores the polarizing atmosphere of this election cycle, with MSNBC journalists and commentators urging the public to consider the broader impact of such rhetoric on American society. Scarborough's remarks reflect a larger conversation on MSNBC about the role of the media and its critics. In an era of rising partisanship, the press faces increasing hostility, especially from figures who see the media as an obstacle to their narratives. The network's coverage aims to shed light on these issues, encouraging viewers to recognize the importance of respectful and constructive dialogue. As this narrative unfolds, Morning Joe and other programs continue to spotlight the consequences of unchecked, inflammatory language on political and public behavior, particularly during a time as crucial as a presidential election. This ongoing coverage by MSNBC seeks to inform and prepare the public to engage thoughtfully with the news, mindful of the influence that both leaders and audiences have on the tone of national discourse. Stay subscribed for more videos.